The Boeing 737 can't dump fuel, and that's not a design flaw. It was built never to need it. Unlike long-haul aircraft like the 777 or 747, the 737 doesn't have fuel dump nozzles. Why? Because the maximum takeoff weight and maximum landing weight are almost the same. According to Boeing's official 737 documentation, the aircraft is designed to land safely at almost any weight if a 737 has to return shortly after takeoffs. Due to an engine issue, cabin pressure or medical event, the crew simply lands overweight. There's no fuel dumping. Instead, the aircraft is inspected on the ground for any stress to landing gear or structure after the overweight touchdown. By contrast, long-haul jets take off much heavier than they can safely land, due to full fuel tanks for ultra-long-range routes. Those aircraft need dump systems to reduce landing weight in an emergency. But the 737's short to medium haul roll means it doesn't carry enough fuel to overload the structure on return. The 737 was designed for high frequency operations, short routes, fast turnarounds and reliable dispatch. Adding a fuel dump system would mean extra plumbing, weight, complexity and cost for something it simply doesn't need. So Boeing left it out by design. So no, a 737 can't dump fuel mid-air, but that's because it doesn't need to. Would you rather have the safety of a dump system or the simplicity of never needing one?